A while back, I got a large bag of garlic bulbs at Sam's Club, and they're starting to go bad. So today, I'm going to roast some garlic. I'm Tess, and welcome to my kitchen. I took the excess papery skin off the outside of the bulbs, just the skin that peels off freely. I'm cutting about a quarter inch off the top of the bulb and exposing all the cloves. You can cut the bulb in half, but I find it difficult to get the garlic out. And I don't throw away the tops. I use these in stocks, toss them in with some roasting veggies, or just rub them over some bread or toast. This time of year, we have an abundance of garden herbs, so I thought I would add some with the garlic for some flavor. I have some thyme, basil, sage, rosemary, chives, parsley, lavender, and some Thai and Greek basil. I can probably find a couple extra ingredients in the fridge. Roasting garlic is very easy. I have my oven preheating to 400 degrees. I have a sheet of foil I'm adding some fresh herbs, the garlic bulb, a good drizzle of extra virgin olive oil, salt and black pepper, and some more herbs on top. I'm bringing the foil corners up tightly, sealing the garlic and the herbs inside. You can use a clay roaster. I'm putting the garlic in a baking dish and baking these at 400 degrees for about 45 minutes or until the cloves are soft and golden brown. When roasting garlic, it transforms its pungent taste into a sweet, nutty flavor, a golden nectar. The garlic becomes soft and creamy. You can spread it like butter. You can use roasted garlic in a lot of variety of dishes. You can use it to flavor red and white sauces, meats, in burgers, pizza. It's exceptional in pizza. Soups, breads, veggies, pasta, dips, potatoes. The list is endless. You can find this recipe in the description box below. Please come and visit me on Facebook, Google Plus, and Test Cooks for You blog. You certainly can roast the garlic bulbs with simply the olive oil and salt and pepper. You will be amazed at how sweet the delicious flavor will transform your dishes. I placed the garlic in a baking dish and baked it 400 degrees for 45 minutes. I removed it from the oven and let it cool for 10 minutes. The smell is absolutely a smell from heaven. And this is what it looks like. You can loosen the sides and scoop out each clove with a knife. Or, if you give it a little squeeze, if you give it a little hug, you will see the cloves will slide right out. The garlic becomes soft and creamy, and you can spread it like butter. To store my roasted garlic, I put mine in a jar and cover with a good extra virgin olive oil. It will last in the fridge for a week or two, if not longer. I even use the oil that is infused with the roasted garlic in my cooking. Roasting garlic is basic in cooking, easy, and absolutely delicious. Give it a try and enjoy. Thanks for joining me here at Test Cooks for You. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe for future recipes and videos. I appreciate all my viewers, and until next time, much love.